Please, please, dear. <laughs> you're so transparent. I know why you're happy, because Republicans... Republicans pulled their repeal of Obamacare, which means you will be able to continue taking whatever drugs you're on right now. Uh, and I know you're on drugs. I know I am. But isn't this amazing? I mean, for seven years, this is all Republicans live to do. <laughs> Was repeal and replace Obama. It's all they talked about. It's all they voted on. It's like... <laughs> it's like the girl of your dreams finally saying, OK, take me to bed. And then you get her there and... <laughs> Oh, this looks bad for Trump. Oh. Yeah, no. It does. You know how Putin feels about failure. <laughs> That's right. But uh, now, th this health care thing went down because of the Freedom Caucus. That's the artist formerly known as the Tea Party. <laughs> In Congress, Paul Ryan <laughs> wrote a health care bill that somehow covered fewer people than just repealing Obamacare. <laughs> and replaced it with nothing. And it still wasn't good enough for the Freedom Caucus. It's like if you wrote a highway bill that made all the bridges fall down. <laughs> and they said, yeah, but that only kills drivers. What about people at home? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it is amazing what happened during the week. The, the Freedom Caucus kept taking away more things, more health care benefits, to make it more attractive to psychopaths. <laughs> In the last version, they had, all, they had cut hospitalization, doctor visits, maternity, mental health, lab tests, prescriptions, emergency room visits. <laughs> Their version of health care was, if you like your doctor, go fuck yourself. <laughs> and the Freedom Caucus still wouldn't go along with it. Speaking for them, Congressman Ted Yoho said, yes, no, that, that's all on him. That's his name. He, he said, this is his quote. He said, it would still, quote, leave a skeleton for the Affordable Care Act. And he will not stand any health care plan that leaves America with the skeleton. <laughs> He's a veterinarian. <laughs> I mean, a veterinarian. Which means his voters think he was in the army. <laughs> uh, you know... Republicans just have to admit, crafting legislation is just not your thing. <laughs> Calling into talk radio and screaming about Mexicans, yes. <laughs> Posting photoshops of Hillary with devil horns, yes. <laughs> Naming buildings after Reagan, of course. <laughs> Secret gay sex at highway rest stops, yes. <laughs> but not legislation. But, you know, th th there was so much news this week. This was only the end of the week, the health care thing. But besides Trump care, there was the Supreme Court hearings we had. There was the Russia news. We're burying the lead with that. The Keystone Pipeline got okayed today. There was so much news, I'm going nuts trying to keep up. I've got the hearings on TV. I've got the president on Twitter. i got Kellyanne on the microwave. <laughs> <I'm so> <laughs> Now, did you watch those hearings with uh, the nominee, uh, Neil Gorsuch, for the Supreme Court? This is a guy, Neil Gorsuch. He interprets the Constitution as the framers intended when they wrote it 226 years ago, <laughs> which they say makes him an originalist. Also Amish. <laughs> yeah, that's what the court needs. Another guy who says, what would slaveholders do? But here's our real descent into the Banana Republic. Uh, <laughs> Ivanka, you know Ivanka Trump, the, his beautiful daughter wife, Ivanka. <laughs> um, <laughs> this, 
This week, she was given an office right there in the West Wing and security clearance to see classified information. She will not be paid a salary because she's a woman. <laughs> <laughs> but in lieu of a paycheck, she worked at a deal where the nuclear codes will now be carried in a purse from the Ivanka collection. So <laughs> good. But you know what? This is how crazy fucked up we are in this country. <laughs> This is how crazy it's gotten. I'm glad she's there. Yes, this is Banana Republic stuff, but I, next to him, I'm glad Ivanka is there to talk. It's like when Janet Jackson used to visit the Neverland Ranch <laughs> and talk to Michael.